Hi, and welcome to the Old Timer Car Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant, and today we have for you a 2003 BMW 525i. It's the first of the E60 series. Now it looks like it's orient blue with cream leather interior. This was a significant improvement on the previous model. This car comes with a full service history and two remote keys. It's done 147,000 kilometres and it's got the two and a half litre six cylinder engine. These came standard with part electric seats, automatic headlights and automatic wipers. This has just come in and we think these represent excellent value. When you consider that a, a good E39 series, five series from 2001 or 2002, is still worth 10 to $15,000. We think these represent excellent value. It's got the standard alloy wheels. The exterior is actually in very good condition for a car of this color. Looks like it's got the original number plates from new. As I said, it is a 325. Honestly, I can't really tell the difference between a 525 and a 530. There's a bit of difference there in terms of the performance. It still comes with the twin exhaust system. The car is in reasonable condition for its age. And it's very hard to keep a car of this colour looking this good on the outside. The leather is excellent. We've sold a few of these actually with 40 and 50,000 kilometres and the leather is in very similar condition. This car does also have a sunroof and it's got iDrive as well, which means you can basically use this knob here for the interface. So if you've been looking around for a little while for an E60 and um, you know, want to get some of the good service history but you know, you're not looking to spend too much money, you really can't go past something like this. The last, it's done 147,000 k's, and the last service was at around 143,000 k's, I believe. It's registered in New South Wales until June 2015. These are safe, reliable, and they've still got plenty of power. So if you'd like to come and have a look, please give us a call. I'll pop in. We're the old timer centre. We're located in Marrickville, in Sydney. And we certainly do look forward to hearing from you.